hello welcome back to my channel I hope you're all doing really really well today's video is a haul as you've guessed from the title and it's very random like there's everything in it homeware shoes clothes shoes cancel clothes and I also went back to lush but I didn't want to do another like lush haul on its own because obviously my video last week was that so I'm just gonna add it in here I'm not going to go into the description of everything in it as well I'm like, I'll link everything down below so yeah bit of a random haul but we're gonna go for it and hopefully you will enjoy it. First of all, I popped onto Very. Now, to me, Very is quite dangerous because it doesn't actually count as spending your money straight away, which is bad because it means that I spend more than I need to. But I picked up three, three things that I really, really like and they actually all fitted me perfectly when they arrived, which never, ever happens. So that excites me greatly and I will show you what they are now. Okay, so the first thing I picked up is this and it is a little dungaree dress and the back is open like this. Can you see? Probably not. Maybe if I tilt it like this, you can see. So yeah, it's open like that. And it comes probably to, like, comes above the knee. Not just above the knee, but not way above the knee. That, oh my god, that makes no sense. But anyway, yeah. And it has pockets, and it is absolutely, lutely adorable. I love this little dungaree dress. I actually bought it for work, but I'm thinking I might buy some, like, really bright clothes, like, tops to wear underneath it. Um, so I can wear it out of work as well and not just be all black. The second thing is quite different for me. Um, I wanted to get a, like a really classic dress that you could wear for any occasion, at any time of the year, for anything basically, like that go-to dress. So I went with one that's quite, like I would never have picked something like this before. It's black and white stripes. So there's the top and then there's a little belt with it as well there. But it's actually, I'm not going to show you. It's like a three quarter length, so it comes literally just below the knee, and it's a pencil skirt, so it's really fitting. It's such a flattering dress. So I just thought I could wear any coloured shoes I want to wear with it. I can have any cl coloured clutch bag I want to wear with it because it's just classic, it's black and white, but it's really unusual as well. It's not just a plain black dress or a plain white dress. And this was actually from Myling Classes collection on Very. I really wasn't sure whether I would like this when it arrived, but I fell in love as soon as I put it on. So yeah, a little bit obsessed with that one um, but really good to have in the wardrobe like a really good staple dress which I didn't have in my wardrobe actually so yay and then the last dress that I got from Very was this one three quarter length sleeves blue and white stripes fitted around the waist and it kind of goes out into an A line but not too wide if that makes sense so it's not fitted but it's not completely a-line so good at explaining things and it has pockets as well either side i'm obsessed with a pocket if a dress has a pocket i will love it even more i just love having pockets and this it was from very but warehouse on very gonna be my go-to dress this summer i just know it and i also love three-quarter length sleeves i'm not a massive fan of the top of my arms so if if i can find a dress with three-quarter length sleeves which is a very hard thing to do i would just like to add i will probably fall in love with it because I just find them more flattering on me and that dress is just I love it then I went to New Look and I picked up a shirt um, I haven't done the buttons up, buttons, buttons up because I'm really lazy like that but hopefully you'll get the gist but it's a really soft thin almost like like a bit like, I don't know how to explain it like a baby muslin cloth like really really soft and then the sleeves are three quarter lengths um, and they have a cold shoulder bit and they're quite it's, quite oversized, like a really oversized shirt, but I really like it. Wearing it with jeans is just so nice, and also I think it's going to be quite nice tucked into like a maxi skirt for a really chilled, kind of relaxed look. Um, but as you can tell, I'm kind of loving the stripes and the blue and white at the moment. Then what I also got from New Look is actually the top that I'm wearing. Again, stripes and three quarter length sleeves, and it has a little pocket just here as well. Again, another really easy top to just kind of throw on and wear with anything and it's so comfortable and it was only 8 99 but the only thing that bugs me is that they only do it in this colour where's my navy and white stripe where's my black and white stripe come on come on new look get them out because i want this top in every single colour because it's so flattering it's so comfortable goes with anything looks amazing with jeans i just love it and i love the fact that on the sleeves it's like little it's like rolled up at the bottom this one is kind of like a brownie burgundy stripe with a white, white and burgundy stripe. <laughs> but yeah, really love it. I've lived in it since I've got it, so thumbs up to New Look at the moment. They've got quite a lot of really nice things in the store right now, and I think their sale is still on as well, or it's just started, one of the two. So highly recommend you go into New Look and try and find some nice treasures there. Lastly, on the clothing section, so I bought new sandals. They're from Dorothy Perkins. 
and I think they were £12, I can't quite remember. But they're really cute, they do them in loads of other colours, but I went for coral because normally I would go for either white or black or brown, so like your boring colours. But I thought these are really nice, they look so nice with like a blue jean, it's just like a pop of colour on your foot, it makes such a difference to an outfit. And they're so comfortable, like they're really really soft, they're not leather or anything, but yeah, really comfortable, really soft, perfect to kind of dress up any outfit. Just your classic sandal and I really like them. Yes I do. Oh, I actually bought one makeup item as well. It was the Max Factor False Lash Effect. I used to wear this all the time and then stopped and moved on to Benefit. And then I can't afford to replace my Benefit mascara this month. So I went back to this one and my love has been completely reborn. I'm obsessed with it. It's amazing. I love it. I think I might go back to this and not my Benefit. Maybe. We'll see how it goes. But at the minute, I'm loving it again. Then I went to Lush again. And I'm just going to quickly run through them. I think you've probably heard of most of them. So the first one I picked up was the Experimenter, which looks like this. I've seen so many people use this and I couldn't resist it. I had to get it. Mm. Honey Bee, which looks like this. And if you haven't guessed, it smells like honey, which is one of my favourite, 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 favourite smells. It kind of, it smells like, um... Honey, I washed the kids. Is that what the shower gel is called? Have I made that up? It is called Honey, I Washed the Kids, right? Yeah, I think so. I got Dragon's Egg. Went for more of the bath bombs this time. Went for the bubble bars last time. I've got one bubble bar in this haul. Um, and that one looks like this. And there's lots of like flakes inside of different colours, I think, if I remember rightly. And I got the Comforter because... I can't believe I didn't buy it last time. Which we all know looks like this. Yay! I think this normally lasts me probably about four or five baths. It's a mess. Onto the homeware part of the haul. It's kind of a mix. It's kind of Primark and BHS, British Home Stores, if you don't know. And they are currently closing down. I think they've gone bust. Uh, so they have amazing sales on. The first thing I picked up is a set of these cups. And I don't know if the camera is gonna, will it show better on here? No. The colors on the thing, so I might try and do like um, a close-up of it. But it's just a cup, <laughs> boring cup, um, but it has pink and green and yellow and blue polka dots all over it. And I love it, and I got four for when I have a house. But yeah, I love them, I couldn't resist them. And then I think they were only like one pound something each, uh, so bargain, couldn't really say no. And then the second thing I saw, kind of a bit of a silly one. Um, I kind of think I had in my mind gifts, which is still a big plan, I think. But um, it was £9.50 for a set of four of these. I don't know if you can tell, but it's an owl. Um, and you get a set of four, like I said, and they all have different coloured lids. So this is purple, there's also a green, a blue and a yellow one. Literally so cute. And they're glass, so they're really, really durable, really good. And I couldn't resist them. Then in Primark, I literally cannot, like, go into Primark and not buy new bedding. Um, so I picked up a fitted bed sheet, which has got, like, pastel coloured hearts all over. Because we always go for boring, like, white fitted sheets. And I actually prefer white duvet covers and patterned fitted sheets because it just looks cute, okay? Um, so yeah, I've got these ones. And then lastly, I picked up a double duvet set, which is white, um, but it has like stripes in it and it kind of reminded me of luxury hotel bedding. Um, so I couldn't really resist it. This was 18, yeah, 18 pounds, uh, which for double duvet is blum and good, to be honest. Uh, so yeah, I picked that up as well and I can't wait to put this on my bed. I'm also hoping once I've got these on, I'll sleep as well as I do when I'm in a hotel bed because they're usually really comfy, or I find them really comfy anyway. I know some people don't sleep very well in hotels, but I do, and I'm really hoping that because they look like hotel bed sheets, I will sleep really good, let's hope. And that is everything that I brought for this haul, <laughs> basically. And I hope you enjoyed it. Don't know what else to say. I'm so bad at outros. Let me know in the comments what the last thing you purchased was and why you purchased it. Um, thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it and I will see you in my next one. Bye!